Hello, um, this is Mr. D, and I'm here to talk to you today about a book that I actually read fairly recently for the first time called uh, All Quiet on the Western Front by Eric Maria Remark. Uh, Mr. Remark was a German soldier in World War I, and All Quiet on the Western Front was essentially a semi-autobiographical story about what happened in World War I. This is particularly interesting to me because I actually happened to find the book here in SISB's library, and it's a book I've been wanting to read for years, but as my G8 students would know, we were studying World War I at the beginning of the school year, so I decided the time was right to read the book, and it's really left an impact on me because one of the reasons you read is to be able to have a deep experience with something that is beyond what you have done. And the story is essentially the story of a fictionalized version of Remark, where as a young man, right when he graduates from high school, when he's an 18-year-old uh, boy or man, depending on how you view that, he goes off to, World War I breaks out, and he goes off to fight. And it's basically the story of four years of slowly losing his friends and his sanity and all of his connections to his previous life. And you see what this horrific event did to one person. And I found that to be an absolutely fascinating thing to read and follow, especially as I've taught World War I quite extensively through my career as a teacher. To get this personalized viewpoint of it was absolutely fascinating. So again, this isn't a book that I've read when I was young, this is a book I've read recently. I'm always looking for new books to read. I'm always generally reading one uh, piece of fiction and one piece of nonfiction. So, you know, look around the library, see what we have, see what will interest you. You, you don't know, there could be a book you've never heard of today that you will spend the next week furiously reading. So thank you for watching and check out All Quiet on the Western Front.